Feline Khaleesi Virus Infection A Full Guide What is Feline Khaleesi Virus? Feline Khaleesi Virus is a virus that is an important cause of upper respiratory infections and oral disease in cats. Although several different viruses and bacteria can cause respiratory disease in cats, Khaleesi virus is one of the more common infectious agents isolated in cats with a respiratory infection. What are the clinical signs of a Khaleesi virus infection? Khaleesi virus causes the typical typical clinical signs of an upper respiratory infection involving the nose and throat such as sneezing, nasal congestion, conjunctivitis, inflammation of the membranes lining the eyelids, and discharge from the nose or eyes. In addition to these typical symptoms, cats with a Khaleesi virus infection often develop ulcers on the tongue, hard palate, gums, lips, or nose. These cats will usually salivate or drool excessively as the ulcers are very painful. Other nonspecific signs of an upper respiratory infection include anorexia, lethargy, fever, enlarged lymph nodes, and squinting. How does a cat get a Khaleesi virus infection? Khaleesi virus is highly contagious and infected cats can shed the virus in saliva or secretions from the nose or eyes. It is speculated that the virus may also be shed in urine or feces, but this is not considered to be a major source of infection. Susceptible cats can get an infection by direct contact with another infected cat or by environmental exposure to objects that have been contaminated with infectious secretions. How long does a typical Khaleesi virus infection last? Once a cat is exposed to Khaleesi virus, it will go through an incubation period of 2 to 6 days before developing clinical signs which typically last for 14 to 21 days. During this entire time, the cat will potentially be infectious to other cats. How is a Khaleesi virus infection diagnosed? In most cases, a presumptive diagnosis of a Khaleesi virus infection is based on the characteristic clinical signs, especially if ulcers are present. How is a Khaleesi virus infection treated? Most cats with an uncomplicated Khaleesi virus infection can be treated symptomatically at home. Your veterinarian may prescribe an eye medication to be applied topically if your cat has a purulent, green slash yellow, eye discharge. Although viral infections do not respond to antibacterial drugs, broad-spectrum antibacterial drugs, for example, amoxicillin clavulonic acid, brand name clavamox, doxycycline or azithromycin, may be prescribed in an effort to prevent secondary bacterial infections from complicating the disease, particularly in kittens. How can Khaleesi virus infections be prevented? Since Khaleesi virus is a highly infectious disease and apparently healthy cats can be carriers of the disease, it can be difficult to prevent your cat from exposure to the virus. Preventing direct contact between your cat and other cats will greatly minimize the chance that your cat will pick up an infection. In addition, following good sanitation and hygiene practices, such as washing your hands thoroughly before and after petting another cat, will reduce the likelihood that you will spread the disease to your cat. Objects that have been contaminated with Khaleesi virus can be disinfected by soaking for at least 10 to 15 minutes in a solution of bleach and water, one part bleach to 32 parts water. The standard core vaccines that are given to cats include immunization against Khaleesi virus and will help reduce the severity of disease and shorten the length of the illness if your cat is exposed. Are other cats in the household at risk of infection? A cat that has a Khaleesi virus infection will be infected to other cats during the incubation period and for at least three weeks after developing symptoms. Is my family at risk? Khaleesi virus is very species-specific and does not represent any risk to people or other species of animals. Thank you for watching.